Rising with the Wind, see drama. The story revolves around the revival of a national brand in the face of the impact of e-commerce. Su Si, an investment professional who moves back to mainland China from a Hong Kong investment bank, meets Jiang Hu, the only daughter of the chairman of a national clothing conglomerate. Due to their differing business philosophies, the two are at odds with each other. When Jiang Hu's father's company suddenly goes bankrupt, she finds herself plummeting from the heights of success. Meanwhile, Su Si, who has always been ambitious, sets his sights on the rubber-soled shoe brand Tingyue, which was once created by Jiang Hu's father. Determined to save Tingyue at all costs, Jiang Hu, despite her downfall, engages in a fierce battle with Su Si. Ultimately, their interactions and struggles will determine the fate of Tingyue and whether it can be revived. The story follows Su Si, an investment professional who returns to mainland China from a Hong Kong investment bank. Once he met Jiang Hu, the only daughter of the chairman of a national clothing conglomerate. However, due to their different business philosophies, the two were at odds with each other. Jiang Hu also suddenly found herself falling from the peak of success after her father went bankrupt. Meanwhile, Su Si, who is always ambitious, is targeting the rubber-soled shoe brand Ting Yu, which was created by Jiang Hu's father. Determined to save Ting Yu at all costs, Jiang Hu, despite her fall, engages in a fierce battle with Su Si. Ultimately, their interactions and struggles will determine the fate of Ting Yu and whether he can be revived. In the process, they fall in love, Rising with the Wind Chinese Drama Ending. Rising with the Wind Chinese Drama has a happy ending. At the end of the episode, the stubborn Yi Guaming finally confirmed Jiang Hu's management ability and handed over Bu Yunxia to her with confidence. After Su Si arranged everything for Ting Yu, he asked Wu Guang Lei to give Jiang Hu's car and the share donation agreement of Ting Yu to Jiang Hu. Jiang Hu, who knew that, then looked for Su Si all over the country but couldn't find him, and finally learned from Hong Dai that Su Si had gone abroad. Feeling lost, Jiang Hu finally realized that Su Si really loved her, she drank Su Si's favorite milk tea alone and shed tears. A few months later, Bu Yunxia and Ting Yu moved to a new factory, and Jiang Hu and Xiang Chaoyang discussed joint model creation between the two brands. In the new factory, a puppy who looked like Boss walked by Jiang Hu's feet, Jiang Hu turned around, and Su Si stood opposite her, 